Yo, what's up guys? It is your boy Bugs, and it's finally time to get Agent Smith free and early starting tomorrow. And I'm gonna be showing you the fastest way to do this. So the first thing you need to do is grab a friend and get to riffing. Yes, so I don't care. You gotta drag a friend, beg a friend, go to these uh, multiverses discords, grab somebody, go on Twitter, go on Instagram, go on Facebook, grab someone to do your riffs to make this an easier experience. So when you're doing these riffs, you do not have to 100% them. You just have to hit the threshold. And the threshold is literally shown when you join the riffs. So when you join the riffs, right here is your threshold. Right here, it says 90 stars, and that is it. The reason why you only need to get to 90 stars is because when you get these crates, these are your gem levels. This is how you level up your gems. After that, getting any more gems does nothing for you besides level up your battle pass. And we don't care about the battle pass right now. We care about getting Agent Smith as soon as possible because you have to beat 20 bosses to get him. And the reason why you want to bring a friend is because every challenge that you do requires you to another player so that's just a free start on all these challenges and etc um you know every time you do it you gotta just keep repeating it on different difficulties again it's the same threshold you're gonna get a higher level gem over and over and over and it keeps increasing um make sure you do your daily gem rewards if you kind of been doing it and it's not like your first time starting riffs um do it on higher difficulties i learned that when you do it on higher difficulties you actually get better rewards for your gem boosters so w on that um and yeah as, as long as you keep doing all your uh, your riffs and hitting the threshold right here, your gem level will be enough for the next um, riff, as you can see. It goes vice versa. It keeps going over and over. You don't need to you know, do anything extra. You don't got to buy no gems. Just make sure you keep hitting that threshold. Once you hit this threshold, see, as you can see, they're different. This one's 68. Just keep doing that. And then there's actually a bug. I want to say is this one. Ah, so you see right here how I'm at 66 and 61. It's because um, PFG actually decreased how many stars you need on riffs. Um, by like I think 10% or, or like 15% or something like that. So if you have this bug right here where you're kind of ready past the threshold because now it's lower, all you gotta do is load up any random rifts, it'll become completed. So I completed this rift just to kill two um, two birds with one stone. As you can see, this is my rift opening for um, completing my daily and also, um, you know, getting that extra um, threshold that I made. As you can see, bam, daily brought, bam, I got the box for here, and yeah. So a cool trick that could save you a lot of time not spending too much time in the rifts is that when it comes to these last three rifts, um, you only have to complete all of it for the, like the first two, you know, easy crushing because you need your insanity level gem. But once you get to insanity, you actually don't have to complete it like the other ones. So for example, uh, when you get in here, you know, you usually want to hit every rifts and, you know, hit all this stuff for stars when you get to this all you gotta do guys is just go straight across and just you know try your best to f finish it as fast as possible because at this point you don't need the gem level anymore all you need to do is complete your boss fights and that is it so again you're gonna keep doing that as you can see for this one i didn't even need it at all so i just skipped right through it i skipped so many levels because why would i even want to do that i think i even did it for another one as you can see the first one right here like i just skipped it because i was like why am i gonna sit here and do all these riffs when i really don't have to so for example if you're like me and you finally caught up and you got all 18 um riffs to, um completed when it comes to tomorrow which will be you know july 8th you actually don't have to do all of age of smith literally try to find the quickest and e easiest route you don't even have to care for the stars because the stars mean nothing to you now the stars are nothing you just want to complete it and beat the boss so try your best to do that as fast as possible and you'll get agent smith as soon as possible i think that's all the tips i can really give besides you know actual tips on like how to beat certain riffs if they're difficult I actually do have a video about that already on my youtube channels you could go check on you know how to um your, the best tips for um riffs and yeah, that's it for the video, guys. Leave a like if you like the video. Comment anything. You know, I love y'all comments. And enjoy the race for whoever gets Agent Smith first. And if you do enjoy multiverse videos, hit the subscribe button, guys, and I'm out. Peace. Yeah, she got a man, she don't really give a fuck about left from back home in a whole nother state. Moved to LA, cause she wanna be famous. Got another five on the side, she a waitress, but it's getting tough. Hard to find